What are y'all doing? Huh? There's Ellis. There's Zoe. Alright, so what we're doing is we are setting corner posts for the new chicken yard. These are telephone posts before they've been dipped in chrysote. Is that whenever the, we've got a company here in Jasper, Texas that dips these pressure treated telephone poles in chrysote for the local power companies. And these, before they are dipped, if they're damaged in any way, then they will sell them as a coal at $2 a foot. If you go down to the local feed store, that you're going to pay $14, $15, $16 for a post that is five and a half inches across. These are measuring eight, nine, ten, and eleven inches across. So you're getting double the pole. Hey Zoe. Hey Zoe. Uh, uh. See there? Rabies vaccine. Well, never mind. She took off. But anyway, she's had her rabies shots and Alice is going next. So you're paying two dollars a foot for the same price, about the same price that you're going to buy by from a feed store, but you're getting double your money's worth. This one here is eight foot long. It is set three foot in the ground. And we are getting ready to set another post eight foot over. And we've got some four inch post. And we're going to be running the chicken wire. What we did, we run this line using six foot six inch tall T post. We've got the wire in the back of the truck. We've got these two corner posts set. And the fence is going to be going back that direction. All right, so this is what a damaged post would look like. You can expect to find this type of damage on it. There's like some type of impact happened right there. I don't know how good y'all can see that. This is uh, with my new smartphone. So I don't know if this is the first video with my smartphone, so I don't know how it's going to turn out. Some type of impact happened right there and may have broke this section off. But... What I've got is instead of a five and a half inch post for 16, 14, 15, 16 dollars, the bottom of that is 10 and three quarter inches. I made. Hey, buddy, what are you doing? You're marking my post? That's my cousin's dog. The bottom of it is 10 and three quarter inches, measured the base before my cousin and I set it. So that is twice of what, almost twice of the size of pole you're going to be getting for the same money. Twice the pole, same money. That's hard to beat. They cut it for you, load it on the truck or trailer with a big forklift, and you are ready to go. All right, so there's my setting of uh, using telephone poles for corner post. Those uh, from the inside edge of that, that one, and the inside edge of that one is something like seven foot eleven inches, seven um, seven foot ten inches. We're going to notch them out, put a beam in there. Uh, four inch post and then do our cross brace, but that's what it lit if you're thinking about using a telephone post for Corner post is that call around find a chrysoding plant instead of getting some of the old used post And these things are going to last almost hopefully almost forever. All right guys and girls. That's the video and I will talk to y'all later